All right, what's up, guys? And welcome back to Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. So I found the last episode extremely, extremely interesting because after all of the events that occurred, obviously we were kind of like brought into the Templar universe, if you will. We even got a little special ring and then, you know, it didn't take long after they found out that we were actually not who we were saying we were, that we actually killed the assassin and took over him. And, you know, we we're just, you know, doing pirate things and it's interesting because now we we are pretty much back to being a pirate so it's like edward has taken the robes of an assassin yet he doesn't he, he just does not understand what being an assassin really is i feel like eventually during the story the assassin uh way of life is going to catch up to him and then he's going to have to embrace that and uh probably balance the life of a pirate and being an assassin so far we're only three episodes in by the way yes that's the beautiful ship we're only three episodes in and oh look a dolphin you, this is exactly why this game is special we're only three episodes in and this this is right up there this is right up there with ac2 right up there so far my favorite of the ones that we've played recently is ac2 on the top and then it's maybe Brotherhood or this one. Uh, that's that's my crew right there. By the way, before we continue, um, we are in a brand new sequence, of course. But I have here um, Edward upgrades, which I wanted to see what the heck this is. So I, I want to say that we don't even need. We probably don't need a shop to upgrade these things. I'm probably going to wait a little bit and see what you guys have to say. Um, oh, but this is cool. The Crimson Privateer, Pirate Captain, Merchant Outfit, Politician, Explorer, Governor, Officer, Templar. <laughs> I'm going to wait a little bit more. You know, we're not going to get into all that crazy nonsense right now. Uh, we've got an objective and we've got a couple of missions that we have to head to. And we got to finish off this uh, sequence. So that is the plan for this video. We're going to finish this sequence. I've actually recorded, uh, this is the second episode I recorded back to back to back. So typically I record one episode, then I record another one the next day, but I finished the second episode and I was just so excited that I had to jump back on. It, it, that's so freaking, that's how much fun I'm having. If, if, does that make any sense? The Abaco Island. Oh, God, this is so fantastic. God, I love this game. Ooh, it's so beautiful. Okay, guys, we are here. We are in uh, Abaco Island. Let's see what we got here. So hunting wildlife, iguanas killed and skinned. Shoot an iguana. What was the object? The ob the optional objective. So you can hunt animals and then skin them to collect animal goods. These resources allow you to craft new items and upgrades for Edward. <laughs> Air assassinate an ocelot. Well, that's quite disgusting. But hey, you know what? I understand. You're a pirate. These things gotta be done. Did I kill it? I did not. Or yes, I did. I have doubted myself. The thing is, where the hell are we gonna find an ocelot? I feel like this is just filled with iguanas. Nothing else. There we go. Very, very nice. Sorry, buddy, but uh, got a mission, and that is you die or not. How is this thing still fucking standing? Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> yeah, that's messed up. What I want to know is how these things got here in the first place. So anyways, uh, this Tyro captain for his first order as a quartermaster, I'm not even going to pronounce his name, Adewale, Adewale, 
suggests that Edward does a little hunting and uh, go fix himself up. So we've got ocelots killed and skinned. Craft a new holster and craft an, a health upgrade. Here we go. Pistol holster. Oh, cool. So this holster allows Edward to carry one additional pistol. That is pretty nice. Oh, wow. Okay, so progress tracker. I just crafted a new holster. What are you talking about? Health upgrade. Confirm. This protective gear increases health. Okay. Then so we have both of them done. Correct? Alright. Ooh, we have a treasure map here. What do we have here? Hmm. So, in front of the big rock. Oh, this is so fucking sweet. I think we can also sync up here, huh? I just realized that there was an eagle there and we didn't even sync up. Oh, wow. So, there's a big rock in a corner. And in front of that big rock, that's where we can get the treasure. Let's see. You're probably going to laugh at me, but it's taken me like 15 minutes to realize that the, the treasure is not here. Okay, so 749625. If I go to my map, it is, it is not here. It is clearly somewhere else right now. Okay, so it doesn't matter. We've... We, we, <laughs> We've got the treasure map. That's all that matters. We'll revisit this. Okay. We will indeed revisit it. And I'll just kill another iguana. Just for no reason. Need some bones. Cool thing is you can get this and just travel back to your ship. That's pretty sweet. Now let's go speak to my quartermaster. Ahoy, Captain. Find what you need. My needs and wants are oceans apart, mate. But I did fashion myself a new holster. All I need now is a pistol to lie in it. Yeah. Taken from the holds, just as you said. A little more than a blowpipe. But they'll do. So, are we rested? Or should we idle a while longer? Best way, Anchor. I think the crew is itching to reach civilization. You'll find no civilization in Nassau. But it's a fine place to be merry all the same. Perfect. So multiple pistols press Y multiple times. Um... These shots do less damage, but interrupt attacks. Mains up, let's go! All sail, she'll take it! Okay. Here we go. So I'm assuming we're going to that big old part over there, right? I love the singing. I thought that was a Valhalla thing only, like... I guess not. Is it here where we're going? Travel to this lo Yeah, sure. I'm Is this where we're supposed to go? Oh, Bahamas. Go on, Captain Queer Nubs. Tell me I'm under arrest. Tell me! Damn your breads. Fly away, boy. I'll back to your master. Aye. We was privateers together before the wars ended. I'll see you ashore. The Bahamas, bro. Look at these fucking islands, dude. Now, if you remember, Bahamas and Cuba are relatively close to one another. So, yes, this does make perfect sense. Oh, dear God. What a magnificent... I'm sorry, I'm going to be drooling all over this game for like the next 
month or so. Okay, so we, uh, I think this should, yeah, here we go. So yeah, pretty much everything that we've been playing, I don't know any of it. Whatever we saw in the beginning episode was just a fraction of what I remember from this game. All of this is new. My God, you're a sight for salty eyes. Come you in and have a drink. Morning, all. Oh, I can't wait. Who's this? Adewale. Adewale. The Jackdaw's quartermaster. Jackdaw. <laughs> you named your brig after a poxy bird. Ade, these lads are the better part of our growing confederacy here. Ed Thatch, Ben Hornigold, James Kidd. You let him carry a pistol, do you? Peace, Ben. Ade saved my life. And now we're looking to find a crew to fill out the rest of my ship. Well, there are scores of capable men about. We use caution. A shipload of the King's sailors showed up before night back, causing trouble and knocking about like they own the place. Right. I'll see you I can muster. Okay, so the Jackdaw, uh, Jackdaw's crew. This meter indicates the crew's strength. The crew is essential resources that allow. Um, is an essential resource that allows uh, you to plunder ships. Bigger ships require more crew to... Okay. Jackdaw, uh, Jackdaw's crew. There are two ways to recruit crews. You can hire people in a tavern or you can help people in trouble. Pirates recruited. Oh, crap. 15. Send any men you find to the Jackdaw. Put them to Cheers, Ade. Okay, so we are gonna go on a recruit hunt. We're still strengthening our crew, I guess you can say. Waiting for this guy here to not look this way. I don't like the look in his face, you know? Sorry, bucko. But these are my men now. Oh, four already. Okay, that's not that bad. Damn, dude, this is really nice. This Bahamas um, area here. This is fantastic. Wow. Oh, this guy's being... Uh... You'll not get free, Jack. Born in line. Hold on. Sorry. He got this. Oh, he just kicked me in my nuts. <laughs> Getting kicked in the nuts is that bad? I mean, it is realistically, but. I was not expecting that from this game to get kicked in the nuts. We're only three episodes in, man. What's going on? <laughs> Double assassination, that is. Perfect. Okay. That's four of them. Oh, hold on. We can sink we can sink up here. Let's go. I could have probably killed them from the freaking sink point. That was dumb. Seems like this uh piece of uh architect here needs a little bit of a repair. This one I thought Cuba looked great. This looks this looks really great. The fortress over there. I wonder what that's all about. So the more crew members we have, the better we'll do against other bigger, stronger ships. God damn, those fast! Woo! Pull me from the deep there, Captain. I am a master assassin. I've only been on the job for like a week. What can I say? I, I've, I've, I'm destined. I cannot wait for this. I mean, I don't know if this is going to happen, but I would like to see what happens when this guy comes across the Apple of Eden. I don't know if that's going to happen. It, it's happened every single game so far, but that would be some shit. Hey, didn't we just do this earlier? Ah! 
Oh, well. All right, you guys are free. That's four. Reach the hanging. Where is that? Captain Kenway, come fast. The soldiers have kept a man uh, in iron. How do you know who I am? This pirate bears the blood of many innocents on his hands. His and a clear shot. <laughs> well, uh, that was a little. That was a little rude of you. If I do say so myself. I was extremely rude of you. Uh, who do you think this is? What? what? I will shoot you in the face and then kick you in the nut. All right, you just you're just gonna keep breaking my teeth like that. You got a good job on you. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh, sh All right, it's time. The assassin blades, the hidden blades. Break the defense, can we? God, this guy's fucking annoying. Bro, this guy's got nuts of steels. What the fuck is that? Nice. Bless your timely britches, Kenway. It's like everybody here knows me. A very popular guy, you know. Reach the tavern. All right, let's go back to our crew. Let these guys know. We're not here to play games. We're, we've made it here. We've made it this far. I've killed an assassin. I've killed multiple assassins. I may not know yet, but I will become an assassin officially. I hope. A little music playing and everything. Okay. <laughs> now you'll want to sail somewhere rich with plunder. Have you heard of a place called the Observatory? Aye. It's an old legend, like El Dorado or the Fountain of Youth. What have you heard? It's meant to be a temple or a tomb, hiding a treasure of some kind. That's it. See here. Oh, oh rot. It's fairy stories you prefer a gold, is it? It's worth more than gold, Thatch. Ten thousand times above what we could pull off any Spanish ship. Robbing the king to pay his porpoise is how we earn our keep here, lad. It ain't a fortune. It's a fantasy. Oops. can wait not a bad looking tinder box you got there you sound a bit green horny gold is it envy because mine's bigger than yours no i reckon it's this jamaican funk i prefer the spanish stuff so you've got yourself a fancy brig now fine well i'm gonna teach you how to say it all right and how to take a prize the proper way. Thatch, we'll catch you up at the old fishing village. Aye. Where's your helmsman, Kenway? I take pride in piloting my own ships, Ben. Keeps me alert. Let's make some headway, shall we? I've no need for schooling. How many prizes did we take together as privateers? <laughs> There's a chasm of difference between joining a raid and captaining one. We're looking out for merchants, boys! Them that's fat with cargo! Find us a schooner with that spyglass, Kenway. You'll get yourself a glimpse of what sort of cargo they're shipping and a general idea of their toughness. Take out your glass, Kenway. Schooners are too small to peep with a naked eye. There's a prize worth taking. Good! Take us in close. After Perfect. you subdue a prize, project authority. Demand respect that you would never give yourself. This weaves a spell over soft minds. 
For your victims must always have in the back of their minds the uneasy idea that you could snap at any moment and unseen them from Oh, there's two of them right here. The fire chain shot. Look at the front of the ship. Fire what planets you will. The land of you strikes is not. But for God's sake, don't sink. It's no fun to far though at the sea. Nice. Nice! Incapacitated, uh, incapacitated ship. When a ship is on fire, it means it's incapacitated. You can either get close and press B or... Okay, cool. Let's go. Okay, these guys are shooting at us too. Hold to board. Oh, shit! Let's go! <laughs> oh my God. This is some real pirate shit. Uh, why are you hitting me? You're supposed to be on my side. Oh my God. This is so cool. Oh, now you guys want to give up, huh? We just raided your death. <laughs> We just raided the ship. Que tengo un buen día, señor. I am Captain Hornigold, and this is my crew. We're sailors like yourselves, but quite unalike in our purpose. For we intend to take all that you owe. Yet no harm shall befall any man so long as he remains at ease. Is that clear? No me mate, señor. Tengo familia. Te lo suplico. Anyone speak English? English? L little bit. Tell your friends we're stealing your goods. And we won't hurt nobody if everyone stays as still as a sandbar. You got that? Please do repeat. Oh, for fuck's sake. Lock them in the hold and take everything that isn't nailed down. So the ship boarding, what should we do uh, with the ship? Repair the jackdaw? Yes. That's right, because our ship was pretty banged up. Oh, shit. It's a shaky feeling sailing about with this much stolen cargo. Cargo plundered. We'll need to take a few more prizes to make this a profitable day. Hold on. Fire! Reload. Won't miss next time. Give me some strength, Captain! Use chain shot to fire! Oh no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice. So cargo plundered. Man, the water looks fantastic, dude. Holy cow. Jesus, look at this freaking water right now, like. You're in big trouble now. I love how you can chain these attacks. Oh, you're screwed. <laughs> Let's go. We'll sail to Salt Key. And buy the intermediate home. Okay. So we're doing this. Uh, we're we're kind of learning the way of... of, of you know, upgrading the ship and fighting against other ships and different types of ships and what alternatives we have as far as it comes to overtaking a enemy ship. We can either breach it, we can destroy it, burn it down or whatever. And we can uh, rescue some, you know, stranded fellows. That's cool. Docks automatically. Salt Key Bank. Interesting. Necesita ayuda, caballero. Sí, caballero. Bye. Okay, Jack 
doll upgrades. Full armor. There's a lot of upgrades, huh? Confirm. That's cool. So you can you can upgrade your ship drastically. Very significantly. That is cool. Mission complete. Use a swivel to kill sailors. Damn, I <laughs> plunder 20 rum. I did none of that. That's my bad. Not a bad take today. Keep this up and Nassau will be the first city where men and women may live as God made them. Easy and free. All it takes is a few drops of blood, sweat, and a swatch of cloth. We fly no colors out here, but praise the lack of them. So let the black flag signal nothing but your allegiance to man's natural freedoms. This one's yours. Fly it proud. I will. I hand over the docket I lent you. If we're to keep our Republic afloat, We'll need guns, as well as gold. That means attacking the Navy. So long as they're flying King Philip's colors will not offend our own monarch. As you've likely seen, cargo. the number of merchants roving these waters is three score the number of military ships. Aye, easy purchase, but in small doses. Right. So to lure the Navy out of hiding, it's best to cause a bit of mischief. Catch a few small fish. Spyglass. So the spyglass is your best to let's see. Look at the ship to see how powerful it is and what cargo it is carrying. Look at the location to see everything available here or there. Hold RB to use it. Military class brig on the horizon. Good eye, man. Are you ready for this, Kenway? She won't go down without an honest fight. Uh, that break, lads. I guess we're ready, boys. That's a sound I like to hear. Hide to corners. All hands to cannons. Careful around the navy. They're as likely to ram you as far a broadside. Let's test those powder barrels against modern Italian. Fine, good thinking. Oh god. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Now. It's getting ready to ram us. Oh, shit. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> this is fucking cool. Okay, hold on. Let's see if we can get the front. All right, we got a brace. Cannons are ready. Get it, baby. Brace, brace, brace. Man, that is OP. Nice. All right, we don't want other ships to come here and interfere, right? down bro nice oh it's done done deal done deal done deal now do you get more materials when you do you get more materials when you actually 
don't sink the ships. That's what I want to know. Oh, God. Perfect. And she's done. Excellent. All right, so we can probably... She's done. She's done. She's really done. She doesn't want any of this. Old beat aboard. Kill enemy crew. Oh shit, let's go. Hey, can we go on those uh, ropes? No, right? We just gotta wait. This is so fucking wild. Incredible. Oh, you almost shot me there, bro. Have you lost your mind? Let me say, for not being a trained assassin, Kenway's pretty fucking... He's pretty slick with it. Metal 65. So I want to say that for sure. When when you actually board the ships, you probably get more mats. It's gotta be. And do you get to repair your ship, or is that because we um? That was a rumble, by God. How do we fare? A fine purchase, no mistake. Now I think it's time to lay low and bribe our way back into secrecy. Agree. So how do we get rid of this notoriety we've stirred up? Money, my boy. A well-placed bribe to the right government official. See the military off your tail. Right, let's do that. I'll need to meet these good Samaritans at some point. Smart thinking. All right, we are back in Salt Key. Okay. Um So what is it that we had to do? Upgrades. The cannons confirm. New item purchased and Let's see if we have anything here. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that is cool. <laughs> that is cool. So we got all of those extra options because we we pretty much have like the you know the bundle which includes the DLCs and stuff like that. Talk to a local officer. Sure. Let's get it. You need to vanish, friend. Right. Oh, that's for the notoriety for the ship. You're a wonder, Kenway. You've a knack for this kind of work. It ain't work if you love it. Ah, ah, Sarge. But I ain't doing this forever, lads. Only until I get enough coin to buy some land and influence back home. <laughs> Jesus, will you listen to your tripe? Still dreaming on about that strumpet back in England when you could have any better you wanted here and now. 
Ah, such lofty goals for you gents. And here I thought I was in the company of scoundrels. Fine purchase today. What's the crew's mood? All smiles and no teeth. And there's a few talking about meeting with Master Kid to steal from a nearby plantation. Plantation? That's ambitious. Profitable too, if we can manage it. Aye. It's a good idea. Okay, mission four complete. Raise the black flag. Okay, so now our watch level has been reset. Give me some speed. Where are we going to now? We ride the wind for all she's worth. So as long as you keep an unwanted, uh, a good notori notoriety level in the seas, you won't get attacked by the hunters. I think is what happens with those other ships, like those enemy ships. Do you have to avoid them with it? I don't know. Interesting. All right, guys. We have arrived to our new destination. Why is our dock? What? No. What are you doing? Just dock the boat. Dock the ship. Can we not dock here? Okay, you know what? Man, let's just do this. <laughs> okay, so you know what, guys? I'll be right back, okay? I don't know what's going on with you guys, but apparently you don't know how to dock a ship. I'll just take matter into my own damn hands. Not the first and won't be the last time I do this anyways. I love how everyone is like in the middle of this deserted island yet there's like a bunch of life in every single little piece of land. How'd you guys get here? I don't see any ships here. I don't see anything. So what what's the dealio, man? Oh nice. Little sink point. I love how these sink points are also not, you know, not everything's a fucking huge tower to climb. That's nice. Perfect. All right. Sugar cane and its yields. Why look, it's the bastard son of the late William Kidd. Still a mere boy and yet ten times the demon his father was. Fancy seeing you here, Kenway. Still looking sleek and mean. Did you steal that costume from a dandy in Havana? No, sir. I found this on a corpse. One that was walking about and talking shite to my face only moments before. Huh. So, what's this I hear about a planned raid on a plantation? Not keeping secrets from me, are you? Not very well. Every day, schooners packed with sugar sail past, coming from plantations nearby. Most times, they stop here, sell off a few crates. There's one man visiting today that had earned you a fine profit. So if you'd like to rob his plantation, I'll point him out. I would. <laughs> Jesus. Is it a Mr. Beckford that owns this plantation? That's the man. He owns dozens round these islands. And he's bloody rich. Just the sort I like to see robbed. His agent is around here somewhere. Find and follow him, and he'll lead you straight to your prize. <clears throat> of 
Okay. Despite the waywardness of your enterprise here, I understand that you are men of discernment. And there's no girls that we can buy here. So we can kind of blend in. Close one. Wait, so is that their ship over there? It looks like it is, huh? Oof. Perfect. Yep, there they are. It's a bunch of them right there. No idea how I'm going to get past these guys, though. How in the world? Burford, Manning, to me. We've done with this place. Aye, sir. What's our course? We'll return to the plantation and there take stock of our inventory. It was a good harvest. You might not talk so loud, sir. This isn't anything like a friendly port, Ken. Nonsense, man. I had a delightful conversation with a chap just now. We came to quite an understanding. As you say, sir. Unfurl, boys. We're going home. All right. Hold you. Okay, reach the wheel. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Captain, you have the look of a man crafting a bold idea. <laughs> look I've seen before. You mark well at it. I've just overheard one of the Beckford's men talking grandly about his plantation and all the cargo he's keeping. Yeah. And it gave me the idea that I might take these goods off him and That's sell them off for a better ship, price dude. than he'd ever ask. <laughs> ah, a man of vision. I like this idea. That's a huge fucking ship. So now we're also headed into unwanted territory. Oh, man. All right, so restricted area. Are areas you're not supposed to be in ships would instantly detect you and attack your entire field of view. Uh, oh, my God. This is going to be a pain in the butt. Our force patrol these waters closely, Captain. Hold on. It's trouble of force. I see them. Okay, so we got to try and maintain our field of view out of way. Oh, we're fucked. Oh, we're screwed. <gasps> oh, we're so screwed. Oh, God. Oh, there's a stranded uh, sailor somewhere here. I will... <gasps> Danger has passed. Oh, Star Wars ship closing. Big Caesar Cutter. Royal Bloody Navy. Seems to be alone, sir. We're fucked. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Why is our ship so slow? It's like we're not even able to go full speed. I really don't want to get spotted here, man. We're heading straight for land, sir. This man is working for Peter Beckford's people. Do you know them? The Beckfords and their sugar empire. Aye. The Beckfords and the Draxes. I never worked their plantation, but I knew their names from hearing other men curse them. But you worked the plantation, no? A modest one, aye. As a striker in the boiling house. A boiling house? Was it water they boiled? 
something else. Cane juice. It's a hard process making sugar. Dangerous. Must be why it fetches such a dear price. What's it like? Toiling on a plantation day and night. Well, with the cane sugar cut and harvested, it's run between two metal rollers that crush the juice from the plant. After collecting the juice, it's time to boil away the water from the sugar. This we did in tatches made of copper. But let me tell you, brother, boiling sugar is near the hottest thing on earth. Just a touch on the skin will stick like wood lime and burn on, leaving a terrible scar. Jesus. Okay, we're about to get out of the danger zone. We're good. Wow, I can't believe we didn't get detected. <laughs> it's a risk to anchor too close. A soldier roving the plantation would catch us for sure. Drop here then and sneak ashore. We'll look after the jackal. Perfect. Reach the agents. Oh, we can fast travel too. Interesting. I was, I was starting to wonder that. In this game, this is like really open world. Like this is more open world than... Than ever before. Oh, fuck. Shouldn't have killed him. Oh, God. such disarray bit of a do sir that's all it's Wilmington's birthday and you saw fit to get pickled on duty no bother sir we have everything sorted we'll soon see won't we for you must double the watch this evening double sir whatever for by pirates Though the ship was uncommonly large for such rascals. Certainly wasn't slavers, though. Not a ship that size. In any case, double the watch. And keep your damned eyes wide for anything suspicious. Oh, God. You up there! Look alive, man! You've a job to do! <laughs> Apologies, sir. I'll keep my eyes peeled. going on here today how do you suppose you'll be able to ring that alarm if you're pissed drunk and barely able to stand forgive me sir i am fit and able if i see any strangeness about you'll hear the bell ringing straight away i promise <laughs> okay so is that his little house over there Could be. Could we uh, dismantle the bells? I'm gonna go ahead and say yes. I'd like to speak to the man in charge here. I require entrance to the warehouse. Which of you dogs has the key to the warehouse, huh? The key, God damn it! Someone find me the key. The Don't leave till it's done. Locate the key holder. No one over here. Fetch me the warehouse key, if you please. To move on. Don't turn back. Don't turn back. Let's see who's got the warehouse key. Ah, there we go. Interesting. Oof. Please do not come here. God. Oh 
god. Oh. I don't want to know how this story unfolds. Oh, fuck that. <laughs> okay, that was easy. <laughs> so you're rum and sugar to the uh, uh to the harbor master or in your captain's cabin to get 800. Here's to our pirate republic, lads. We're prosperous, free, and out the reach of kings, clergy, and debt collectors. Near 500 men now pledge their allegiance to the brethren of the coast in Nassau. Not a bad number. Ruth. Yet we lack sturdy defenses. If the king were to attack the town, he'd trample us. Then let us find the observatory. If it does what these Templars claim, we'll be unbeatable. Not that twaddle again, can we? It's a story for schoolboys. I mean, proper defenses. Steal a galleon, shift all the guns to one side. Would make a nice ornament for one of our harbors. It will not be easy to steal a full Spanish galleon. Have you one in mind? I do, sir. And I'll show you. She's a fussock, she is. Fat. And slow. <laughs> hmm. Your jackdaw handles nice. Pinched her from the Spanish, was it? Aye. In the midst of a hurricane. Just before the treasure fleet was smashed against the shore. Was the hall aboard as rich as men are saying? A thousand times that. I reckon a million pounds worth of reals was sunk that day. Devil love a hurricane. Might have a dive there one day. See what we can rummage up. Diving them wrecks would be a nice change of pace for us. No need for violent actions against merchants and such. Well. That's some soft talk coming from a pirate. And as it happens, I mostly agree. We'll save the clash in the cutlasses for the military. And them that get in our way. Easy as she goes. No telling what you may find out here. I'm staring through a waterfall. Don't saw your breeches, lads. We got this. Oh, God. Use a spyglass to identify your target. It's a gunboat. Where the hell is our target? We have a freaking thunder. Oh my god. Don't tell me that's the ship. Oh my god. That's a man of war. <laughs> Hear that, Ken Wang? Keep your distance. We'll strike when fortune favors us. The cover of darkness, most likely. Ah, oh, you may come to that. Puzzle your tops, Miss Rose! Tops! So we've been sailing this ship for a while now. So when under a mortar of fire, the area of damage is represented by the circle of the water or on the water. The yellow circles announce incoming shots. Avoid them. When they turn red. You'll take damage. Nah, bro. I'm good. Fucking hell, bro. 
<laughs> this thing is ridiculous. I'm just gonna stay right behind it. Oh my! Oh man! Fucking crap, dude! Oof, we almost took that one. Sink the Spanish ships. Oh my god. Ship is pretty strong. I'm not gonna lie. I don't mean to tweet my own horn, but we <laughs> do some pretty decent damage. Okay, let's turn around. Come on, come on, come on. Uh oh, this is not good. Got two, two birds with one stone. That's a good one. Okay, let's take this guy out. He's dead. Sayonara. And there she goes. Hmm. She's sailing for that island. I know the place. A natural stronghold used by a French captain named Ducasse. Julian Ducasse, the Templar. Name's right. Didn't know he had a title. I know the man. And if he sees my ship, he'll know it from his time in Havana, meaning he may wonder at who's sailing her now. I can't risk that. And I don't want to lose that galleon. Let's think on. And maybe wait till it's dark before hopping aboard. All right, mission completes. We've got one more mission here. One more mission. And we are done with the sequence. So this, this, uh, this sequence has been a lot about, uh, I know I could have gotten the loop back there, but it's fine. Or should I get it? Eh, I'm fine. This, um, this sequence, the missions within this sequence have been a lot about sailing and, you know, learning the ways of pirates, if you will. Which honestly, it's not that bad. It's really fun. Like, the, 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 uh, the whole ship part of this game, you know, traversing through land, I mean, through, through land, through the ocean is really fun. Now, it just depends how, how often we're going to be doing this, you know. Gentlemen. As is custom among our kind, we do not plunge headlong into folly on the orders of a single madman, but act according to our own collective madness. <laughs> the object of our attention is a square-rigged galleon, and we want her for the advantage she'll bring Nassau. So I'll put it to the vote. All those in favor of storming this cove and taking this ship, stomp and shout I! Hey! Those who oppose, whimper nay. Ah 
Never was the King's Council so unified. I like the Brotherhood. There is definitely a Brotherhood going on. What the fuck? This is cool. Reach the jungle's exit. The jungle? What? Excuse me? Let's do it then, bro. You know, I'm all about that jungle life. Kind of. I don't know what to expect here, but I am quite excited. I do say so myself. Okay, we'll climb up through here. We left the chest down back there. Unless it's actually higher up above. But that's fine. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh! Oh, God. That felt very uncharted. <laughs> that was cool. Nap break. I mean, are you sure there's no other way to get here, man? Like, there's gotta be another way, Mr. Canway. There's just gotta be another way. Ah, this is the chest. like they, they they did so much work in every single piece of island that you visit like you can get lost in this damn world so easily this is such a huge open world game you know just fantastic sorry dude Please kill both. Good. We are actually inside a fucking jungle. This is awesome. Oh. Did I do it right? Something like that. may ask well because my name is edward kenway i am a savage perfect so the guy i forgot his name now because as you know if you've been watching the channel for a while i am just terrible with names but the guy that was in havana with us the guy that left and he had all those scars he's the one that's interesting I was a little scared of running like behind them too much because then you get spotted or heard. But it looks like it's not that bad. That's such a bad idea after. Bro, look at this, bro. This is absolutely beautiful, dude. Don't fucking fall, dude. Oh my goodness. Is that the Man of War there? Could be, right? Gotta be it. It's gigantic. I oftentimes wonder what the hell are these guys doing so far away from their ship? Yeah, you somebody could say they're patrolling the area, but man, I don't know about that. Should we go ahead and get this? Might as well, right? Can we even get it? 
course, anything is possible. If you just believe. Okay, we're almost there. Why are they both looking though? Oof, perfect. Okay, so now when that guy turns around, I'll kill the next guy. And the next guy. Perfect. Right behind the tree, so we can't even get spotted. That's just great. Magnificent. Excellent. Oh, we've got a fucking sniper. Are these guys going to continue looking this way or are they going to look away or what's the deal? Oh, oh, and there's these two guys here. Holy crap. Okay, we're free. Free to go. There it is. Oh, wow. Look at this place. Wow, man. This place is freaking beautiful. Huh? Holy cow. This place is beautiful. Yeah, come here, dude. I'm about to kick your ass. I dare you to come here. Oh, you have a death wish. Don't you? You just have a death wish, don't you? I'll get this guy over here. Hold on. I'm gonna wait for this guy to try. The thing is that... Alright, yeah. I can whistle to this guy. He'll come this way. Bro, look at that freaking shit, man. If we were able to take that ship... That'd be so cool. Nice. I don't know if we're going to go un unspotted, if that's even a word. But if we get spotted, I, I, I wouldn't be surprised, guys. Okay? Just, just letting you know. We're not very good at this whole hide-and-seek game. Okay. There's a guy this way. Come over here, stupid. Yep, right behind you. Right over here. That's right. <laughs> Excellent. So many of them, bro. Hmm. 
Come on, bro. Fuck. Please don't spot me. Excellent. No way. No way. No way. There's no fucking way. Everything was just going too good. That's fine. We totally, totally redeemed ourselves. Look at this. Bro, this looks incredible here. What's going on here? Stealth swim. Bro, how are we still standing? Like, what is this? This is by far the most beautiful place in the entire game so far. Look at this. With that ship in the back. <laughs> oh, this looks so fucking sexy. Okay, so we're going to head this way. That was a lot of guards. I'm actually surprised I took all of them out. Okay, so we can take this. Okay, where's my targets? Hold on. I'm head upstairs. Perfect. Okay, here we go. Damn, I can't believe we're killing this guy already. That he'd last longer into the story. Oh, this is a huge ship. I don't think we're going to be able to kill this guy. There's just no way. Oh, this is the guy with the hat. See that the cargo is secure. shield all day all day every day oh he's reloading god fucking damn it god you're annoying now How many times have we kicked him in the nuts? Oh my god, this guy has some good counters. I like that though. And and some of the other games, like even the bosses, even, the, even though this game doesn't really have like bosses, or at least the ones that we played, bosses, bosses, they were just way too easy. Good one, they're a little bit harder. That's it, bro. I'm gonna 
reload. Or I can actually uh, take away his weapons, right? If I pull out my fist. But what fun would that be? <laughs> Remember the gift you gave me? Well, it answers just fine. Fist of Putra! As bold as a musket ball, and still half as sharp. I'm sorry about this, mate. But I can't risk you telling your Templar friends about me still kicking around. I pity you, Bukenye. After all you have seen, after all we showed you of our order, still, you embrace the life of an ignorant and aimless rogue. Ah. What's this? His petty larceny, the extent of your ambition. Have you no mind to comprehend the scope of ours? All the empires on Earth abolished, a free and open world without parasites like you. Que l'enfer que tu trouveras soit le fruit de ton insouciance. The cove is ours! Nice. Very, very nice. There it is. A single madman. I just saw you were logging out, so I thought I'd stop by and give you something. A little welcome gift. We give awards to our top-notch employees for doing quality work. And they're nice to have, since there's no official bonus scheme here. I already have about 11 or so. Oh. Bonjour. Of course. I'll pass it on. Well, looks like Olivier wants to meet with you. It's exciting. Follow me. It's on the top floor, so it's not hard to find. But the rest of this building can be confusing to first-timers, so we had the tools team whip up a great map application. Check your communicator. I added a waypoint to Olivier's office. Should be easy to find. All right, guys, we're going to end it here. We are now back in the real world. And uh, I'm excited for the next one. This was a very long one. I don't even know if we're going to be able to do episodes by sequences. I think the sequences in this game are almost Should as... Be easy to like, find double as long as the previous ac game so we might do half a sequence per episode i don't know we'll see how the next one goes but thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed it as always if you'd like to see more ac4 here on the channel drop it a like and i'll catch you later